Okay, today is the 9th of March 2019, oh, it's Saturday, and it's a beautiful blue sky at the moment, although uh, I'm not sure if it's going to stay that way. The weather forecast is for rain later, uh, so I can't read really anything that's too much in the way of electricals and things. We get panic and pain for the moment. First of all, uh, move this a bit further that direction so that I can uh, get at the bit down here, the concrete underneath. I need to then carve a hole down and through that way, which will then come out about, well, where that bit of, bit of dirt is over there, and it needs to be underneath this gravel ward. Uh, this is for the pipes, the water pipes, that are going to go into the shed, so the sink. I also need the waste, but the waste is going to be has to become a bit higher, but it come through. I uh, may have to actually carve a hole through the um, gravel board, but we'll worry about that when we work it out. And eventually joins here, where the downpipe for the toilet, for the um, uh, summer house, I think it's named right? summer house will be. And while I'm at it, the first thing I do though is get this. Uh, uh, bit here replaced it's like it's off, uh, broken so I've got another one I have got a u-bolt thing to go around I'm not sure what I'm really going to use that because it's a uh, mm, I want something that really goes through those holes and just about above it but I can't seem to find anything that matches that so I might have to try and see if I can knock something up or do something but at the moment for the moment I'm just going to replace it anyway I have another one for that purpose. So that's the first objective. That should be relatively straightforward. <sighs> and then things like the um, window, if I get a chance on that, and drilling the holes in this bit of wood. In fact, it's the end bit of wood here. I need to drill some holes in it, ready for the uh, wall when it goes up. Okay. Oh, I'm also bidding on a sink, a uh, stainless steel sink, which will go in the well, we'll go about here, but uh, of course you can't really see it at the moment. <laughs> no wall. That's effectively against the wall here, uh, so that I can uh, uh, wash things. <laughs> this is also why I need the pipes in. Anyway, first objective, get this cover off and um, get these things moved a bit over. But that I need the boys' help. Okay, we've moved the uh, side walls up a bit, so I can have space to get to this section. Uh, so much keeping it dry, and pools of water on the on the end, which oh, hopefully we're going to not doing any good, but I'm sure I can come up with an answer. Uh, hopefully, get the thing vertical, so at least it's uh, you don't get pools of water; it runs off. <laughs> uh, by the way, the weather. Uh, you know the blue sky I showed you a little while ago, well half an hour ago to be precise, it is now uh, grey and I'm looking. Anyway, I've got my angle grinder out, attached a dummy one cutting blade and I want to cut a slice of concrete out of here, which would be one end of the pipe. And obviously the enemy sky underneath and cold chisel and hammer it out. Uh, anyway, hopefully the weather stays reasonable, I'm going to cover this over before I go any further. Hopefully the weather stays enough we can enough to actually get some cutting done. On wood. Bye. Well, that's quite impressive. Uh, five minutes I've cut all the cut the uh, slots I intended. I'm going to get cold chisel and hack them out. But uh, that was quite uh, quite good. As so I like a hot knife through butter, but uh, it was still pretty pretty rapid for what I was expecting. Anyway, onward. Okay, I'm now down to the hardcore base. Well, sorry, it's about an hour later, and I've got to now cut that direction uh, towards the fence. Uh, it's actually taking less time than I imagined, which is because this concrete isn't as thick as I thought it was. But anyway, onward. Okay, there we are. Hole dug. Got to the gravel. Uh, well, you we can't actually see it from here, but got to the gravel board. Uh, I now need to dig from the other side and uh, 
underneath underneath where the gravel board is so we can put the pipe in. Well, the pipe yet, but that's where it's going to go. Once that's all done and in, the pipes are in, fill the thing up with concrete and uh, put it nice and firm. Okay, so for the moment I now need to move a load of soil from there, get slightly further along, and dig that back. And, uh, carry on. In the meantime, actually, what I've done is, I mentioned it earlier, but I think I've done it. And I put a new uh, latch thing on there, so that one feels a bit stronger than the other one. I hope it's going to last. The other one was very weak, or well, certainly one side was very weak, not properly joined. So, okay. Hobwood. Okay, I've uh, dug out this area. You can see, usually back here and out all the way over there. I've uh, cut some slices out of the block and I'm currently removing the rest of it. So, hopefully, uh, I actually cut more, cut more slices now to remove some of it. And then that eventually goes back to uh, the other hole. I hope you enjoyed them all. Okay, onward. Okay, I ended up removing quite a few more bricks and a bigger hole than I really intended, but well, at least we have a hole. And I'm not sure how well I'm going to do this, but you may be able to see light coming through from the other hole. Anyway, the other hole, of course, being going around here. That one there. Yeah, we actually can see light like, coming through this way. through and then uh, put everything through uh, concrete it all back up again. <sighs> Onward. Oh actually uh, I think it's the possibly last video for today. I've got to take the boys to violin because it's Saturday and uh, by the time I get back because they've got two an hour less than each it's more likely going to be getting dark so I'm going to get more today. So I need to pack up and I think that's most likely to be the last recording of today. Okay, onward. Well, see you tomorrow. Bye. Okay, it is now Sunday the 10th of March. And the weather is, well, it's very windy at the moment, so... Bright sunshine, warm rain, and... Uh, well, I'm not sure exactly how to stay anyway. First thing this morning, I... Um, I shall obtain this for a uh, very, very reasonable price. Uh, <laughs> I've seen worse second-hand ones. This one's brand new um, for higher prices, and this one, this one's really good condition. The only dip thing, slight thing about it, there's a dent here. But to be honest, it's going in my shed, so I'm not really going to worry too much about things on that line. And it's very nice. Apparently, that's the reason. That's the reason it was rejected. Oh, and I thought if you're paying a lot to have a nice kitchen fitted out, you don't want dents and things. So, it comes with all the fittings and everything as well. Quite pleased with that. And uh, certainly the price, yes, definitely. Okay, main plan of campaign today. Here is the window. I've got to fix, effectively get the shutter finished. Uh, the idea is this thing will um, uh, put it in place and it's not going to hold, but basically something on that line. I think it's a bit too tall at the moment. So it needs to, in fact, no, actually it's not too tall, because it's going to need to go there. And I've got bolts and hinges with these people on. So basically, make that. And finish that off. Now, hopefully the weather doesn't rain. I don't know if you put up with the wind, I can't really work in the water. Anyway, onward. Okay, it's midday, and I've put the other bits of wood on, screwed them all in, put the hinges on. Unfortunately, <laughs> the bolts are too long. <laughs> really, because I was originally thinking of having it connecting through two of these two bits of wood, rather than actually just a single bit of wood. But that means it's not going to work. 
so we've added a bit over. I might actually have to get another hinge in the centre as well. The bolts are then, the then going to go through both of them, but uh, that's going to fit. So we'll put the uh, lock here, which is currently sitting over there. <sighs> and obviously it's going painted and everything else. But anyway, onward. Okay, there's the window in place with the shutter. You'll see no glass or polycarbonate on the front at the moment, and it's not painted. Uh, we get around the other side. The uh, oh, I get up here. Right, shutter opens. So bolt. I think hold up. And I also put the bits of wood in around the edges. They're not. Uh, well, I'm going to nail them. They're not in yet because I've got to put the uh, bolt, bolt polycarbonate in place. And also uh, replace these screws with bolts. But uh, oh, I don't need these as well, I think. But at least it's progress. Alright. Uh, a bit hinge in the centre, maybe. Okay. Onward. Oh dear, the weather keeps raining and stopping and in fact you've got blue sky, but it's currently raining at the moment. Uh, and sun, you can see by the shadow. <laughs> right, drilled the bottom bit of this wood, it's all the required holes. So I can't really do any more for the moment because I need more wood for the uprights. <sighs> so I'm packing everything away even though it's quite early. Uh, I don't I don't really like being in this weather. Apart from that, it's a uh, power tools in wetter water don't really go very well. So, I'm sure I'll find other things to do inside the house. Anyway, onward. See you next week. Bye.